So I am at work and I'm on lunch break and I'm tired and ready to go. And this is only day one of two. Just trying to make it through this week because then I have five days off. So tired. I am leaving work, dog ass tired, about to go get something to eat. This is how I look at work. No makeup, hair's a mess, and I'm tired. Literally, this is how dark it is outside when I come to work and when I leave work. So on the weekends, we get to park in the parking garage for free, which is always a bonus. But I usually have to walk further than this. Today, I work tomorrow, and then I come back on Thursday, and then I'm off for five days. I do work the day before Thanksgiving, and I work Thanksgiving, which sucks. But I'm off Christmas and Christmas Eve, so that's kind of the schedule that I got. I didn't want it, but whatever. So I work the holidays I have to work is Thanksgiving, and I work New Year's Eve. So it is what it is. Um, just kind of trying to deal with it. Like I really have no other choice right now. <laughs> so my husband told me that there's a possibility that we might be coming up on orders within the next six months. Which means that within the next six months, there's a chance that the army can say, hey, guess what? You have to move. Which means we pack up our shit and we leave. So, it's not like signed, sealed, and delivered. It's just still a possibility. Which means most likely it will happen. But I was a little disturbed because the two places that they really need dental NCOs, which is what my husband is, um, is Fort Hood. His mom lives there. <laughs> or Fort Seal, which is my hometown, which is both of our hometown. Um, and my mom lives there. And I love my mom to death, but living back at home just does not sound appealing right now. So, yeah, that's kind of not what I really wanted to hear. I really wanted Fort Carson or Fort Huachuca, which Fort Huachuca is in Arizona, and Fort Carson is in Colorado, but, or to go back overseas, um, but it seems like none of those three options are available, so we're kind of stuck with two options that I don't want. Or he can go to Korea for a year and then we get duty station of choice which would most likely be back to Germany because I love Germany and I miss it so much. So, I don't know. We'll see. But I have to get home. First of all, I gotta give me something to eat before I like literally die. Today is Wednesday the 17th and I just got up a little bit ago. Um, I put my boys on the bus at like 6.20 and then um, I went back to sleep for a little bit um, but then I couldn't really like sleep because I knew I had so much crap to do. Excuse how I'm looking like child I'm tired. Um, so yesterday was eventful. I, I experienced my first cold on my own patient um, yesterday at seven o'clock in the morning. So right when I got report, um, CPR on a real person, it's freaking hard and it is very tiring and I need to lose weight because I was out of breath. <laughs> this morning I woke up, I feel it in my arms and my back and I feel like I've been doing sit-ups. Your girl is so out of shape. So, um, yeah, she's, uh, my patient, um, you know, is still alive, but CPR is very hard and I'm very tired. So I have a lot of crap to do today. Um, well, probably over the next two days and probably the entire time I'm on break. Um, or I have like five days off after I work Thursday, I work tomorrow and then I have five days off and, but I work on Thanksgiving. 
and then the weekend of Thanksgiving. I work the day before Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving, then I'm off on Friday, but then I work Thanksgiving weekend, so Saturday, Sunday, Monday. Um, so my schedule sucks, but whatever. Um, I have a lot of cleaning to do. Um, I have to meal prep as well as I need to find, I'm in the process of separating my boys rooms because they've shared rooms since I've had my youngest. Well, yeah, since I've had my youngest, um, and they have, we have an extra room that is like a game room, but it's time for them to get their own room. They have so much stuff and their room, even when they clean up, it just looks dirty because it's just so cluttered with like toys and junk and they have so many clothes that it doesn't fit in the dressers that they have in that one room. So I'm in the process of moving them rooms. Um, so I have to find a, I have to find two twin frames, um, bed frames, and then I have to take everything out of that room, throw away all the toys that they don't use, separate all their stuff, um, take the TV that's in there out and probably put it in the garage. And then we have another flat screen for that room. Um, so it's just going to be a freaking process. Um, I'm also thinking about switching cell phone companies. Um, so I need to go and handle that. And, um, I need to clean out my garage. <laughs> my house is a mess. It is a freaking mess. And I need to get it together because this is ridiculous. So, this is going to be a lot of cleaning. Um, I need to, so I'm going to eat breakfast and then I'm going to watch a couple of YouTube videos and then I'm going to work out and then I'm going to start cleaning up. Um, and I also need to research where I can get some bread, bread, <laughs> some bed frames. And I also need to wash and deep condition my hair. As you can see, it is looking a freaking mess. Like, look at these roots. Somebody told me that they like my dark roots. Girl, look at that. That is straight black to blonde. Like, that's not cute. Like, no, hunty. That's not cute. Y'all are not going to have me in these streets looking crazy. Er. <laughs> so, um, I need to wash my hair. I need to film a freaking wash and go for you guys. Because I'm going to dye my hair this weekend. It's going to be a surprise. So, yeah. Like, have you ever just had so much stuff to do that you just... Literally don't want to do nothing. Like that's how I feel right now. I'm about to watch Code Black. And probably order pizza because I don't feel like cooking. Like I'm so tired. But I get five days off, which is freaking awesome. Even though I'm going to spend majority of it cleaning. And um, trying to switch my boys out of one room to make two rooms. Um... My life isn't a lavy life, guys. I'm like a real-time mom with real-time issues and a real fucking job. And, like, I don't, like, YouTube is not my life. I don't go on trips and, um, you know, stuff like that. So, this is kind of what I do. This is why I don't vlog a lot, because I work a lot. And I take care of my kids even though I don't show that part of my life a lot in my vlogs, I give you guys a little bit here and there, but I just feel like kind of my time with my husband and my kids should be kind of my my time and then the time where I'm just out and about by myself and like shopping or working out or doing stuff that's related to kind of what my YouTube page, my YouTube channel is kind of geared towards. That's what I share with you guys. So I just want you to understand that as well. Um... But yeah, this is kind of my life by myself when I am not being mommy or being wifey or being nurse. So, yep.